stakeholders in the agricultural sector are calling for serious control on uh, regulation of hazardous pesticides used by farmers on their farmlands. According to them, these chemicals found in uh, many of these pesticides have long-lasting effects on crops and are indirectly consumed by citizens. When you start to use a um, chemical pesticide, at first the idea is to cut down pests, you know, and when it cuts down pests, um, you could get more yield, but this happens just in the short term. In the long run, the chemicals that we apply on this, uh, the crops uh, go back into the soil, it kills the microbes in the soil, so when it kills the microbes in the soil, your soil loses retention, your soil loses nutrients, your soil loses organisms that make your plants grow better, so what it means is you have environmental issues at the end of the day you have soil fertility issues so you have to spend more money on fertilizers you have to start looking for more irrigation to pull waters on your farm you know and then of course a lot of these chemicals the recent research global campaign have showed us that a lot of these pesticides a lot of especially those that are highly hazardous pesticides especially those that are extremely hazardous pesticides a lot of these pesticides are already banned in Europe. We are talking to government since this product has been banned in the in Europe or in the US they should also be banned in Nigeria. We know that we used to do farming without, you know, this pesticide. Our parents used it. They used to do without pesticide and they were producing food. Government should come up with alternative, sustainable way of, you know, uh, uh, you know, controlling weed and pests instead of using this hazardous, harmful pesticide that have actually brought a lot of problems to the entire country. Farmers are adversely affected in terms of pesticide poisoning um, when they use this, uh, pesticides without um, wearing the personal protective equipment and sometimes even when they wear those equipment. And, and also we have the pesticides running off to contaminate water, um, drinking water sources and water that is used for other, other functions. And so uh, we have people coming down with several illnesses, cancers, immune disorders, infertility issues, you know, that were, uh, that were not at the rate at which we have them today. If we are going to tackle the issue of pesticides in agriculture, we need to come together as regulatory agencies and probably, like we canvassed before, have a pesticide control council uh, where we bring together all these agencies in one room uh, for the purpose of regulating the pesticide industry. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.